a muslim is somebody who submits their will to their creator exactly. right That's so right. if somebody submits their will to their creator that makes him a muslim so jesus peace and blessings be upon him submitted he did the work of his creator so I by definition jesus is Gabriel, okay I, I you believe, believe jesus is gotcha. the head of islam christianity and judaism you believe jesus what he's a master master uh, I believe Gabriel that overshadowed Muhammad. But Gabriel is an angel. I right? But do you believe Jesus was an angel? No, I believe Gabriel was over, came to uh, Joseph in a dream. That's Master Jesus, and well, he's an arhat at that time. Which Joseph are we talking about? Muhammad. Uh, I think. All right, so Gabriel, let me try to understand this, right? You're Gabriel saying. Gabriel was one that overshadowed Muhammad. Is that correct? What do you mean by overshadow? I mean he was He brought the Muhammad. message to him. Yeah. Yeah. So you believe Jesus I believe is Gabriel? Right. Jesus overshadowed Muhammad. So yeah, he's a Muslim. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so I'm I'm glad we agree that Jesus is Muslim. Yeah. But let's try to work through the rest of that, well, right? Let's say Master Jesus is uh, 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 I'm sorry? Well, I believe Master Jesus overshadowed Muhammad. Master Jesus? Yeah, because you have Gabriel, right? Okay, but Gabriel's an angel, right? Where does, where does Muhammad get the, the message? So right? some of them are directly to dreams well, and messages. Who, 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 who is Muhammad uh, overshadowed by? Uh, overshadowed might not be the right word here, so well, let, let me Gabriel, let me explain, right? right? Okay. So the the angel Gabriel would bring the message from Allah to the Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon yeah, him, like he brought to the other messengers, like Jesus, Mary, and you know his mother Mary and uh, Abraham and Moses, well, peace and blessings be on Gabriel, all of them. Uh, mentioned in the Bible when uh, Jesus was born. Uh, is he, he brings that message, right? All right, so, so he, he's the one that brings the message. Well, who Gabriel is the biblical story and Muhammad. How you doing? Well, who's Gabriel? Gabriel's an angel that brings the messages. Who says he's an angel? Uh, the Quran. Well, I believe he's Master Jesus. You believe Gabriel is Jesus? I, I so, right. but, but, but let me ask you, so I have a Bible. Okay, sure. So uh, I'm here to help you. So here's a Bible. Is there any? Oh, you got one. Excellent. What is it? Well, let me check that out. What, 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 what is that? Is that like the Gita or? Nice. So can you give me any? Uh, so can you give me any textual evidence that Jesus was Gabriel? Uh, well, there's no mention in the biblical story and then the mention of Christ. Right, right, but, but, but where did it say that Jesus... All I know is Master Jesus overshadowed Muhammad. What, what do you mean by Master Jesus? Well, he's, he's a... Like, isn't Jesus a servant of God? Yeah, he's a servant. Okay, so, so the servant of God, Jesus, um, was brought the message to from Gabriel. So how could he be the same person? Sure. So, so Jesus is not God, though, right? But, but how could he be the servant of God and God? Well, because we've never really met Master Jesus. If I met my prophet, he's God. Okay? You would think but he's I, God, I but know. is he God? Well, according to Muhammad, he's God. Allah. Allah is God, yeah, Allah is God. but Allah is not Jesus. But, but again, so Allah 
is the master of all the prophets. He's the king of all the kings. He's the only God. The Quran tells us that Allah has no sons, has no children, has no is not born out of anybody, and is doesn't have anybody born from him. I do. Uh, I actually teach his life. From the yes, the only time. The only time he traveled was on the on the uh, the what you could say the supernatural event of Isra al Mi'raj when he went above the skies. Uh -huh. But other than that, he never traveled outside of Arabia. Well, we don't. We don't really, is there any history? Yeah, there I is. Mean, you look at the four Gospels. Jesus comes out of nowhere. What, what was it for the last uh, eighteen years? We don't know, but nobody really knows. For well, sure, but, but the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, the difference is we have a detailed record of his entire life oh, yeah. in the books of Tariq, right? I have a series I'm teaching right now oh, yeah. from before his birth. Uh -huh. We talk about who his mother, his father, his grandfather, great-grandfather, great-great-grand. We can show you lineage way up and the context of where he was born and first-hand accounts of the miracles. He could have traveled. He couldn't have because because we would have had records because we have records. He went as far as Sham, which is current day Syria, right? But that's it. He never went to like Greece or Italy because we would have had records that documented his life. So, so he came to our kind of lay down the law. The Quran. the Quran was revealed to him, so he conveyed that which was revealed to him. Well. What was going on in Arabia before that? Do you think the magic and all kinds of there was, yeah, there was and worshiping of idols That's and right. all kinds of bad stuff. Yeah. Burying their own daughters alive, all kinds of stuff that the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, from the message that was revealed to him, put an end to all of that idol worship and yeah. burying and saying, you cannot bury girls alive, they have their own rights. He gave the virtues of raising daughters and so on. And he stopped many bad practices like enslavement of free people and so on. You know, without any war, they would just take a free person and save them. The Prophet ﷺ put a stop to that, right? The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, That's brought it. Uh, right? What, what is the date when uh, Muhammad came? I'm kind of curious. I'm going to write this down. Because sure. I, what, 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 what year did Muhammad give the Prophet? I'm just kind of curious. I'm going to stop here. So, uh, I, I, I'm, so what year was so it? Let me, let me do you one better. See, you, you have your phone? You have your phone? No, I've got it. Oh, okay. So, so give me a paper and pen. I'll give you the YouTube channel. Okay. Yeah, you, you can do that. Because I'm trying to figure out where the... No problem, I got you. Crusades kind of... What is that? Crusades? It was some kind of movement that lasted... I don't know much about the Crusades. I don't know much about the Holy Crusades. Sorry? The Holy Crusades. The Holy Crusades were uh, wars initiated by European uh, Catholics, I guess you could say Christians, to try to conquer what they call the Holy Hands of Palestine. So, I'm sorry? No, no, it was initiated by the Western powers who came from Europe and attacked Palestine, Al Quds, to take it away from the Muslims. And the Muslims fought back, like, like Salahuddin and stuff. And the Crusaders would rape and plimage. You can you can look it up. But I gave you the YouTube channel called One Message Foundation. Okay. So when you go there, there's a playlist, the life of the messenger, peace and blessings be upon him. So it'll give you all the dates, when he was born, when he became a prophet, what are the historical evidences, the fact that Gabriel was an angel, not a prophet, um, who brought the message, how was it brought, you can get all of that there. Oh, okay. Excellent. So you believe that the Bible is the word of God? Yeah. Yes, you think so? You, think well, I mean, so? you don't in, seem too sure. In the Bible, biblical, so it's but do you believe the Bible is the literal word of God, or do you think this is the writings of men that could be wrong? I believe it's translated by men. It's the same. It's must be translated. Maybe it's the So, so are there errors in it? What? Are there errors in it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So then it can't be the Word of God, because the Word of God wouldn't have errors, Exactly. Right? I say it's my trace of thought. Okay, when you read the New Testament, it's my trace of thought. I mean, what else it's what? It? It's my trace of thought. My gotcha. trace is a world teaching about I, I the messages. It's, gotcha. So but it's not the words of God, but, then. But Christ, my trace of Messiah, Krishna, Imamadi, Imamadi. Mahdi? Yeah. Yeah, he's a prophet. Uh, yeah, but Mahdi hasn't come yet, right? Oh, yeah, he's kind of large. But no, no, he didn't die. That's the Shia stuff, he but he, no, not yet. Yeah, it's his time. Well, there, there are signs. 
that have to come here. No, no. So, so, so there is a hadith in Sahih Muslim that Jesus, peace be upon him, will pray behind Mahdi. So it can't be the same person. So in the Bible, for example, Second Kings, chapter eight. I got you. Second Kings, chapter eight, verse twenty-six. Isaiah was twenty-two years old when he became king. And he reigned one year in Jerusalem. His mother's name was Athaliah, the granddaughter of Umri. So, how old was he? 22. Uh, Isaiah? I wish I could. Gotcha. No problem. So, in the same Bible, 2 Chronicles chapter 22, verse 2, Isaiah was 42 years old. Yeah? Is that a. Same king? Right of Jerusalem. Here he's 42 years old when he became king and reigned one year in Jerusalem. His mother's name was Athaliah, the granddaughter of Umri. So now you have the same person. No, no, Umri, Umri, right? So this same king became king, ruled one year, same mother, same grandfather, same Jerusalem. One says 22, one says 42. Oh, I see. So there's a clear numeric contradiction, right? If you look at the genealogy of Jesus, you will find a clear contradiction as well. Right? For example, in Matthew, you will find, and Jacob begotten Joseph, the husband of Mary. Right? So Jacob, not Mary, but the husband of Mary. Joseph was born to Jacob. So who's Joseph's father? Jacob. Right? But in the same Bible, if we go to Luke, and you see now Jesus himself began his ministry at about 30 years of age, being the supposed son of Joseph, the son of Heli. Again, not about Mary, because it's his son, right? But Heli is the father of Joseph here. So, yeah, it's been translated. They took out the incarnation too, right? So, so then you, yeah, you would agree that this is... This, the, huh? We're on the same page. The Bible has been tampered with. It has been changed. This is not the pure words of God. But the Quran is the pure words of God. you have a Quran? Uh, I need it. You, you do now. It's a gift. And it's free. Right? So, it's okay. We don't want any money from you. We're not trying to make money here. We spend our own money. None of us here are paid. Yes. We come out here just for the sake of our Creator to share the message. Right? So now, the message of Islam is there's only one Creator. Right? That one Creator is not a man, he's not Jesus, he's not Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon them. He sent us messengers, messengers with messages, right? So Allah, there you go. So you believe in Allah. My, my, uh, my uh, doctor told me he's, uh, he's Jewish. He says Jew means believe in one God. One God? Excellent. So you believe there is Allah, one God. We are getting there. Yeah. So if there is one God, that one God created us. He's not a man, he's not a woman, he's not a dog, he's not a monkey, he's not a statue, he's not an elephant-headed human, none of that stuff. One great creator, there is nothing we can even compare to that one creator. Agreed? Excellent. That one God sent us prophets to guide us. From Adam, from Moses, Abraham, Jesus, and Isaac. You have the succession of prophets. Next one is Excellent. So, so Ma Mahdi, prophet. Mahdi is not a prophet, well, I mean, but he will be a guide. Right. Excellent, man. You already know about Mahdi. We're, we're, you're ahead of the game, right? So, me and you both believe now there's one creator, Allah, right? Yes. We believe in messengers who came in succession, right? Tawasal. Excellent. That's in the Quran. So, from Adam to Muhammad, I believe in all the prophets. Do you believe in all the prophets? Yes, I do. You're Muslim. Yeah. Excellent. The Old Testament and the prophets. So, the Old Testament and the, and the New Testament, me and you have already agreed, has been changed. But this in your hand is the unchanged, preserved words of our Creator. Yes, because it's from the original Do you and know it? The Bible has been translated. So all right. So, you believe in one Creator? Yes. You believe He sent the prophets? Yes. You believe in Muhammad being the prophet? Yes. Sir. You believe that all of them were prophets? None of them were gods themselves? Yes. Right? These are all prophets, like Jesus, Muhammad, were prophets, right? Yes. Excellent. Peace and blessings be upon you. You are Muslim. Yeah. Now we're going to do the Shahada. You're going to do your testimony of faith. And after that, you are a full fledged Muslim. 
Your brothers will get your number. Right, so now you, once you say Shahada, not just friends, you'll have 1.9 billion brothers and sisters in America and all over the world. All right. So, uh, those are all your brothers in a minute. Let me do the Shahada first. All right. So, we will do it in English first, right? Say, I bear witness. I bear witness. There is none worthy of worship. None worthy of worship. Except Allah. Allah. And I bear witness. And I bear witness. I bear witness. That Muhammad. Muhammad. Is a servant. Servant. And messenger of Allah. Is a servant and messenger of Allah. Of Allah. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Allah. You're a Muslim. There you say Allahu Akbar. <laughs> Allahu Akbar. There you go. You're good. <laughs> so now we'll do we'll do it in we'll do it in Arabic now. Okay. Ashhadu al la ilaha ilaha illa Allah il la Allah wa ashhadu ashhadu anna Muhammad abduhu wa rasuluh Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Alright, now the brothers get the brother's number so we can keep in touch with him get him some لا بد يوما آتية كل الخلائق حاضرة كل السرائر بادية